All right, hey y'all, welcome back. I'm John, and today we're going to talk about how holding off, procrastinating on starting your investment journey can cost you hundreds of thousands of dollars down the road, even with relatively moderate amounts that you're actually investing. Now, if you've not been to my channel, here we talk about budgeting, saving, investing, and building a a life of abundance, right? That sense that you can do it. There's a lot of negativity in the world where people, it's us versus them, the the rich are bad, they inherited all their wealth, they spend all their time, you know, on yachts or whatever it happens to be. But the fact is, is the majority of millionaires are first generation. And something I learned a long time ago when I was very young that put that seed in my mind was that you don't have to go off and be a neurosurgeon and make you know seven hundred thousand dollars a year to be rich if you just have discipline a plan and time on your side you can use small amounts and grow them to really large amounts now again i'm not saying that you're going to retire on your yacht uh, smoking cigars and jetting around the world to have lunch in paris but we're talking about not starving, right? At retirement, not living off what Social Security is gonna give you. What kind of nest egg can you build for yourself? The discipline comes in that you've gotta do it and do it consistently. Forget that money is over there. Don't go tap into it to buy a car and take vacations and things like that. Let it grow. Ignore it through the downs and the ups. Just every single month, drip money into it. And the longer you do that, the bigger your nest egg is going to grow above and beyond what you have from your employer in a 401k plan, for example, and beyond what you have in your tax advantaged accounts like an IRA, beyond what Social Security is going to pay you, or similar if you're in a different country, you can do it with small amounts. And that's what this is about right here, but waiting even a year or two years because you think now is not the right time is costing you potentially hundreds of thousands of dollars. Now, what I like to say is that math doesn't lie. So today I'm gonna to pull up an investment calculator. I'm gonna show you exactly what we're talking about here. And I can't give you every scenario that you're going to encounter, right? And this calculator is very simple. It doesn't have a growth. You pick an amount and you invest that for the next X number of years. It doesn't, you know, you, you step up from 100 to 200, whatever it happens to be. It's very, very basic, but go play with this yourself and see the massive amounts. And regardless of whatever age you're at right now, now is the time to start. But today I wanna to show you just how much money you're leaving on the table in the future if you aren't starting right now. So I'm actually gonna go down here. I did a search for investment calculator on Google and down here, I'm gonna click on the one for Ramsey Solutions, Dave Ramsey's company, because it's super, super easy and you don't need to know a bunch of other information to get started. But I'm gonna start, let's say you're 21 years old, you have $100, you're gonna contribute $100 you're gonna do so until 67. Now, you're probably offended at that. You're probably like, well, I wanna retire by the time I'm 40. Then you need to save more, <laughs> right? There's a different plan for that. But let's just assume you are an average everyday Joe, and at age 67, you're gonna retire with full social security and you want a nest egg on top of it. And as I've said in many videos, the uh, S&P 500, the market tends to return somewhere between 7 and 9. You'll also see 7 and 11, 7 and 12 percent. I use 8 percent because it's nice and conservative. And if you calculate that, at age 67, you'll have $576,393. Okay? Estimated. Now, up front, I am not a financial advisor. I will tell you that right now. And a lot of people don't get started for two reasons. Number one is they don't know what to invest in. So you can go to Fidelity, you can go to Vanguard, you can go to Schwab, you can go to any number of other companies that offer investment products. Uh, I have a whole video on my three bucket strategy, the three different funds I invest in to maximize my growth and, and kind of take out the downturns a little bit. and. 
it's easy, easy, easy to get started. In fact, if I switch over here, I pulled it up earlier, the Fidelity S&P 500 index fund, you'll see right here, they have no minimums to get started. So it's not like you need to save up a thousand, five thousand, ten thousand dollars to get started. You can literally start with nothing, okay? The second thing is that people think, I don't have enough to invest. And certainly if you're just starting off, you're not making a huge income, you're just getting by, start with whatever you have, $20 a month, $40 a month. It's not going to make a huge nest egg. But if you get to retirement, you had $232,000 in a chunk, it makes a difference, right? So that was using that $100 example. But certainly as your life continues, as your finances continue, maybe you can get a situation where you and your significant other, one pays the bills and the other one does all the investing. Let's boost this up to $200. Every single month, you'll end up with a nest egg of over $1.1 million. Now, if you're 21 years old or you're 18 and you think 200 is an obscene amount of money, that's okay. But right there, I want you to recognize you can be a millionaire in America, in a free market economy, by investing for the long term, little drips, dollar cost averaging, every single month. You can do it right there. Let's do it 250, just to show you the difference. You're almost at a million and a half, all right? So here's what's important. Let's look at this. Let's say you're 18, you're just out of college, or just out of high school, excuse me, got your first job, and you start doing that. It's almost a $400,000 difference just by starting three years early. Let's go back here and look at 21 again, so you're at 1.435 million. You can be a millionaire. Now let's, let's back this down. Let's do 200, there. You can be a millionaire by starting at 21 and saving $200 a month for the rest of your life. But let's say you're getting started, maybe you're in college, you're not really making enough, the rent is too much, you've gotta buy your first car, dang, you've gotta pay your own car insurance now, You know, maybe you've got somebody you're interested in, you're thinking about marriage, whatever happens to be. So let's say you put it off till next year, till next year, pretty soon you're 30 years old, and you start with that same $200, you gave up nine years, and you lost essentially $600,000 by waiting nine years to get started. Let's play around with this real quick. Yeah, you would now have to put in $500 a month and still not catch up. So I hope you see what I'm saying. Go play, go, go play around with this, guys. The numbers are staggering, and it's something I got very, very young, and I'm here, I'm trying to give it to you. You can be a millionaire in America, in the Western world, in, in a free market economy, let's say, by saving, investing consistently every month for your entire life. You can have a nice little nest egg to live off of when you get to retirement. If you're fabulously successful, maybe you retire early, but you don't want to be relying on the government or handouts. You want to be able to control your own destiny when you get there. And waiting will cost you tens or hundreds of thousands of dollars. So I hope this message is inspiring to you. I hope you play around with this. I hope you see what's possible out there. There's a lot more complicated calculators online that will take into account a lot of other factors but waiting is killing your financial future. So hope you appreciate it. Please be sure to smash that like button. If you are interested in getting started, hey, go check out Weeble. You can get two free stocks when you deposit your first $100 like I did. Guys, that's like free money. Other than that, please leave a positive comment